hi guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to do a review slash demo for you guys and it's a very exciting video I'm so excited to go ahead and review this new upcoming brand I mean it's only Rihanna but as you can tell I haven't been on for a long long time it's very hard for me to go ahead and keep being consistent and I do apologize but I am doing um, not doing but I am in medical school and I'm almost done so I will be able to go ahead and bring more content to you guys and I should be moving out soon so keep a lookout for that and I will do a empty house tour with all of that said we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video okay guys so I know it's a big rave that's going on for Fenty Beauty that just came out a week ago and I am so excited to go ahead and get my hands on some of the products here. I don't have much that I wanted because of course it just came out and everybody's trying to get it. So I got what I wanted, um, not everything that I wanted but I got some of the products that I did um, have my eye on. So. The first thing I did have my eye on and I am going to read for you guys is the Pro Filter <clears throat> Medium to Full Coverage um, Foundation and this is in the color 220. So this is how the packaging looks. So beautiful. And I'm like super scared to like drop it because it is glass. So now it does say um, shake well before use. So I'm only guessing that this is going to be very liquidy. I love this packaging. It's like so gorgeous. Okay. Another thing that I did get was um, the Matchstick Shimmer Skin Stick in the color Unicorn. Now, I am so excited for this and to try this out because when I saw Jeffree Star swatch it, I was like, I had to have it. I really did have to have it. And then when I um, swatched it in the store, along with confetti, I was like, um, kind of torn in between the two. But I went along with Unicorn. They didn't have... Um, confetti so I will be getting that next time but I do want to show you guys because I know there's been a little bit of a dispute on um, other makeup brands and how um, they didn't have enough products but we'll go ahead and show you guys here I'll go ahead and put it all the way up okay so that is how much product you're getting and I believe that this is perfect because it's not only just the right height, but it's very thick. So I think that this will be perfect and usable for a while. Because this is not something that I'm going to be using every day, obviously. I mean, I would love to shower in this product, but you know, you can't. I did get another matchstick skin stick and the color trippin and it looks like this and I kind of love the shape of this and the packaging just because it reminds me of like I don't know honeycombs like a beehive or something in between and I just love the way that if you didn't know already they're magnetizable so if you want to go ahead and um, go let's say on a trip or you want to go travel it's so cute that you guys can just magnetize all of them at once and then take it with you put it in your bag and you're done you know but here's tripping it is like an orange peachish color I didn't expect it to be as beautiful as as I thought it was going to be now when I swatched this on my hands I was like girl I'm in love 
you know I think that this will be beautiful on my skin tone and not only my skin tone but a lot of dark complexions I believe that will be a very big hit for dark complexion women so I'm excited I, I think Rihanna did a wonderful job um, on her line you know I'm so shocked you know I haven't seen any brands come out with as many shades as she did and I have to applaud her for that because you know a lot of these girls can't find their shade and they would have to mix either two different colors to get the color that they need um, and it's really hard you know they have to spend a lot more money than they should have but Rihanna actually did a wonderful job and um, creating 40 different shades for every type of skin um, tone. So, now those are the three products that I did get. I am gonna get everything that's on her line, so can't wait. Little by little, I'm gonna go ahead and get it. So, we're gonna go ahead and start off with the foundation. But before we do that, I'm gonna go ahead and use my one and only that I always use is um to moisturizer is my small size collagen skin rescue lotion and i go ahead and place that all over my face and i did i wanted to get the um the soft matte pro filter moisturizer but i didn't i will get it next time though I am um, I love the reviews on that and how it works so well with the foundation so I will be getting that now that that's done I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put a little bit on the back of my hand to warm it up a little bit so it looks like that Oop. As I said, it is a little bit runny. And I did hear um, other reviews saying that this does dry really fast. So I'm gonna, gonna try to go ahead and um, quickly apply this on my face little by little. And this is a perfect shade for me and I was so scared because I didn't have anybody like match me I actually matched myself I mean who knows you better than yourself right I wish I could have gotten um, the full body brush but I didn't see it there most of her stuff and Sephora is already like out of stock and they actually said to try to go online and get it because not everything online is um, out of stock yet. So, if you're trying to get Rihanna Fenty Beauty, I would suggest you go online and look first before going to Sephora because Sephora um, is basically already sold out of everything. They didn't have Trophy Wife. I really wanted that. Um, they didn't have that. They didn't have the lip gloss. Um, what else? They didn't have a couple of things. They, they basically ran out of all the dark skin complexion foundations. Which I'm so happy for because, you know, like... When I saw the, the video come out, I was amazed. I was so shook. Guys, I'm not even joking when I tell you that my skin looks fucking, sorry, airbrushed, but oh my god. looks like flawless she really outdid herself for real oh 
scrumptious. This is gonna be my new favorite. Foundation, for real, for real, for real, for real. You know what, I'm not... <laughs> this is gonna be my favorite foundation. I'm not gonna be able to use it every day. This is the most expensive foundation I ever bought. And I won't be able to even use it every day. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm just kidding. Okay, and to set that, I am going to use my Airspun um, Translucent Loose Face Powder. And I use this when I don't wear makeup. I put this on my I just use my collagen um, moisturizer cream and I go ahead and put this on just for um, when I don't want to put foundation on and I don't want an oily face. Super full coverage, and this is like with one one um, application. This is not more than two at all, and it looks super full. They said medium to full coverage in it with one application with a very light hand. This is full coverage for me. Girl. Girl. Okay, so we did that. Then we're gonna go ahead and do some bronzing. Bronzing, contouring. I actually looked at Jeffree Star's review of Fenty Beauty and he knocked it out the park. He really did. He right on point. Because when I swatched these, I thought the same thing he did when he reviewed it in his hotel room in New York after the party. So. without that review I probably I mean I probably would have already bought it anyways but I probably wouldn't have bought it as early as I did because I wasn't planning on to I was planning on waiting a whole month waiting for all the commotion to like blow over and then buy it because you know what they say that sometimes there's like little kinks and problems with the um, the formula people break out or something goes wrong and the brand actually fixes their mistake and then they come out with a new formula whatever whatever so I usually wait but if it wasn't for Jeffree Star I wouldn't have bought it this early so serious so I'm not gonna do a full face I'm just gonna go ahead and um, apply the um, matchstick shimmer skin stick and this one's going to be in the color trippin so first i'm gonna go ahead and swatch it on my hand so you guys can see how it 
looks. So this is how it looks. Super orangey and golden-y. It looks so pretty and I like saw how it looked in the sun. We're gonna go ahead and try it on this side. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply it with the beauty blender. like how it looks before so we're gonna go ahead and try it again put some up here and put that out with our finger so we're gonna go ahead and do the flashlight test as Jeffree Star does unicorn and see how that baby looks and I'm so excited to try this I might just want to bathe in it I wonder what is the best way to apply this because I think I'm not applying it correctly. drum roll please okay guys so right now we're gonna go ahead and rate these babies so what do I think about the foundation I don't have words for this foundation like I give it a 10 out of 10 this is a must-have in any makeup artist's bag like seriously if you don't have this you need to go get it it's 34 bucks 34 bucks 
Now, we're gonna go on to the Matchstick Shimmer Skin Stick in color Trippin'. Okay, so I must admit that I'm in love with this color, but I am not too happy about how it comes out. I think it's my skin color because I know that it looks wonderful on darker skin complexions. So maybe it's just that I'm a little bit lighter so you can't really tell. In the sun, I'm sure that it will come out a lot more, but I just wish that it was like as blinding as Unicorn. But I do give this an 8 out of 10. I'm in love with it still. You know, I can probably put it in the inner corners of my eyes or even as a brow bone or even on the nose. I won't necessarily probably put it on my cheeks, but I am in, still in love with this. Okay, and now for my star of the show, which is Unicorn. And I... I mean, you can you see this, right? I don't even have to introduce this matchstick shimmer stick. Like, I obviously give this a 10 out of 10. Like, <laughs> come on, Rihanna just like blew everybody out of the water with this line. I, it just came out of nowhere. This was a brilliant idea. And then, like, all the packaging is just beautiful. I can't wait to get my hands on all the other products and review those for you guys. I'm so excited for this new brand, and I do congratulate Rihanna and Sephora for bringing this brand to life. And super, super, super happy for her. Congrats, Rihanna. Um, bless you, and your brand, your company, that you are taking your time on. Girl, you took your sweet time on this brand and it just came out phenomenal and I do appreciate it. So guys, um, if you guys are not subscribed to me, go ahead and subscribe down below and go ahead and click the notification button because I don't upload as much as I need to or as often as I should but I do upload and when I do I want you guys to know so you guys can get the 411 so notification and subscribe and until next time guys bye